<clears throat> hey guys, it's Mark. Uh, this is the Mark Wilson Sports Show. Today's my day off, so I actually have time to make a video. And um, them them Jets. Oh my God, Geno Smith broken jaw out for six to ten weeks. Who would ever punch their starting quarterback in the fucking face and break their jaw in two places? That guy got released real fast. He's probably not going to get signed by anyone because he has um, other... Uh, um, I was listening to uh, the radio. I guess he like got in like a fight with a cop or something before the Jets um, signed him like a few years ago. So like he's bad trouble anyway. So, uh, but like it's like it's like punching Tom Brady in the face and giving him a broken jaw. Who would ever punch their starting quarterback in the face? You gotta be the dumbest guy in the world. Uh, The Jets are just dumb, and now because it's in New York, they're taking this way, like the report. It's all over the papers and everything. It's hilarious. Geno Smith out for six to ten weeks with a broken jaw. <sighs> no, he might lose his starting job. Absolutely hilarious, and um, yeah. Um, Hard Knocks. I didn't watch the first episode last night. I need to watch it sometime today. Um, I heard. That, I guess they did a huge like Vince Wilfork thing, and I guess the some of the Patri there's some Patriot stuff when they got the Super Bowl rings. There's some. They uh, took some film from that, so I need to watch that today. Um, let's hope Brady gets his uh, four games gone. We can have them. Hopefully that goes all good. And, um, yeah, Geno Smith is, uh, out for six to ten weeks. I was working when I found out, and it was pretty hilarious. And then I put on sports radio in the truck I was working in. And they were just shitting on his life. And they were just shitting, like, New England sports radio was just, just shitting on the Jets rate, um, Jets. It was absolutely hilarious. But um, yeah, this is the Mark Wilson Sports Show. I'll talk to you guys later, and uh, I hope you guys have a good day. All right, bye.